I had left the group, mm -hmm. and I was I got my own studio upstairs from where the Roots record at Sigma Sound, mm -hmm. and um, I was working with this girl Jill Scott. She was working at uh, Urban Outfitters at the time, and she wanted me to help her make some music for her stuff, and so she could get a deal. So we came up with this song, "You Got Me." It was pretty much all the way done. And Questlove came in and said, I have to have this for our album, for Things Fall Apart. And um, it was 1997. And, and uh, I gave it to them, and, and I was assuming that Jill would be on the record. And at the last second, the label decided to throw Erica Badu, and uh, we won a Grammy. What was the process for you like, to come up with that beat in particular? I mean, there was, obviously there was add-ons after the fact that we, you know, uh, but... To start it, I just came up with these chords and I did it, you know, Jill and I did it low. I call it Lennon and McCartney style, um, where we sit at the piano. I play, somebody has a pad, we create melodies, we create chords, and then the production comes second. But, you know, we have a generalized tempo in mind and a feel, so I just programmed the drums around that and bass and, you know, emulated a bass guitar on the keys. And then Hub came in and he replayed it after the Roots accepted it. And then Quest Love as well redid the drums with the same pattern that I created. And then he came up with this idea for the end of the record to put jungle music, the drum and bass break in there. Right. And then took it a step further and attempted to play it live. What's it like just, you know, you know you, you, everywhere you go, you're hearing the song. It's like hugely popular song, like, you know. You know, it's crazy. I have a story about that. <laughs> I remember in Philly driving around in my car, and <clears throat> even though you know, we were successful somewhat in you know, the fact that we had a song on the radio, it, it hadn't hit to us financially. And I remember I saw somebody in the car playing the song, and I, they pulled up next to me, and I was like stressing out <laughs> how I was going to pay my cell phone bill or something stupid. And it was just like, you know what? It's going to be good. <laughs> 